Remember what she was making fun of me about? Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Scott, Wack, and Pete. We left? Huh? Is that funny, too? So today, today I'm going to run you through uh chest workout. So the whole goal of this workout, this style of workout, the whole styles of workout I've been doing is try to get in shape. Uh, it's not a strength training workout or anything like that. So it's the heaviest you can go with the minimal amount of rest. So uh, I've been working with Heath Evans on this. And uh, so basically the whole goal with this is try to get in the best shape as possible. Once you get over 40, this is kind of the style of workout that I would recommend. So y'all be sure to like and subscribe to the channel. And there'll be new videos coming soon, probably on these styles of workouts. So if you like it, be sure to like and subscribe. All right, so here we go. This is the second set of 50 first set I use 50s uh, basically what we're doing here is we're just trying to get warmed up that's all we're trying to do get the shoulders good and warm get as much blood into the chest as we possibly can um, this gets you pretty good fatigued um, this is my second set right here that we that I did this is the 70s and I pump these out for 50 and by the time you get done with this you got a pretty good uh, warm-up um, there's really no need to warm up for me on bench or anything like that. I go right into my uh, sets of bench <clears throat> after I do this. Um, but while we're warming up, we also do some shoulder warm up and I do a little bit of tricep and bicep warm up. Um, by the time I got about 45, this was struggling for me pretty because this was pretty heavy. Um, but today I felt pretty good, so I tried the 70s. Um, this is my actually right here, I'm looking into the camera saying, letting y'all know that. This is not much weight. This is my last set of five with uh, 295. I only done five sets with 295. Um, the first three sets that I did was uh, two, worked up to 275 and then finished out with 295 for the last set. But what I was saying in the camera was it's not a lot of weight, but with one minute rest in between each time, it is absolutely brutal. And you can see that I'm struggling on the last one there. From there, we go back to three sets of 10 with dumbbell incline. This is my last sets of these. On the first one, I was warming up. You could just see me just repping out, rep after rep after rep after rep. Um, not really focusing on stretch or touching together at the top. But on these, what I'm doing is I'm coming down and getting a good stretch at the bottom and then coming back up and slightly touching them uh, together at the top, as you can see. When you touch them together at the top, it kind of squeezes everything together and it makes you get more of a contraction and gets a lot more blood in there. From this, we move over to the pec deck. Um, on the pec deck, you can see that I'll put my hands out, my fingers out right here. Um, when I do that, I actually feel more of a squeeze in my inner chest. I also set the seat where you, it's about, my hands are about nipple high, and then come together and every time I squeeze, I also try to poke my chest out and pull my uh, shoulder blades together. So that way I'm trying, totally focusing on the chest area and not just pushing it together with my shoulders. This was three sets of 15 and everything you see is always my last set that I do. So that's why you see me struggling on everything because it's pretty difficult. And the time I rest in between each set uh, is a minute, but the time I rest in between each exercise is probably a minute and a half maybe. Um, just so just so I can get to the other machine, get it loaded and that sort of stuff. From there, I moved on to the chest press. This is a Nautilus chest press. If you don't have one of these in your gym, you use the hammer strength or whatever you've got. This thing is amazing. But you can see where my hand placement is. Um, my hands are slightly tilted inward and they're right on the edge. And I'm slowing the reps down so that way I can get more uh, blood into the muscle and more squeeze. Uh, this is mainly working inner chest, which I need to mainly focus on. And then the last thing that I did was I've done a one arm isolation. So the whole purpose, purpose of your chest is to bring your arm across your body. That's why your chest contracts when you move it from your left to your right or right to your left, your arm. So on these, what I do is I just push up and I squeeze as much as I can and go down as slow as I can. So basically you're working that, you're working the entire chest, but you're working that inner uh, part uh, the most right here so as soon as I get done I swap over to the other side and do the same thing with the other side now so just to recap a little bit you do two sets of 50 on the dumbbells five sets of eight with the uh, bench uh, three sets of 10 on dumbbell incline three sets of 15 on the uh, cables and then I've done three sets of 10 on the chest press and two sets of 10 right here on this particular one